Israel plans to kill Hamas bosses around globe after war. Here's a summary of the article. When you visit any website, it may store or retrieve information on your browser, mostly in the form of cookies. Because we respect your right to privacy, you can choose not to allow some types of cookies. Blocking some types of cookies may impact your experience of the site and the services we are able to offer. These cookies may be set through our site by our advertising partners. If you do not allow these cookies, you will experience less targeted advertising. These cookies enable the website to provide enhanced functionality and personalization. If you do not allow these cookies then some or all of these services may not function properly. This post received a score of 4400, with an upvote ratio of 93%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Something tells me that the billionaire leaders in Qatar aren't quite as sanguine about martyrdom as the rank and file. Funny how it usually works that way. And has for centuries. They took Eichmann 20 years after World War II. Mossad won't ever stop until they get their man. Eichmann got off too easy. Absolutely, I don't understand what was the point of killing him. Broadcasting the message that time doesn't forgive. Exactly, and spreads the idea that anyone who has done or will do similar things will have to live their entire lives in fear. Interesting fact much of Hamas leadership doesn't live in Palestine. The area they govern, the one where the people die for their cause live. It's almost like minimum 84% of the population, probably more now, didn't vote in the one election the Israeli government facilitated 17 years ago. So Hamas started murdering the competition to secure power. Otherwise the comment could be interpreted as a perpetuation of that conspiracy theory stating Israel created Hamas. The reality is that Hamas has spent a lifetime propagandizing the next generation and turning them into radicals. Hamas has broad support which is why they can operate the way they do. And damn it if anyone knows Israeli history they will hunt your ass down and make a Hollywood movie out of it. That's the most brutal part, when we send in Spielberg. What? spielberg was busy? May they all rest in pieces. I read your comment as, may they all rest in peace, and I was about to pop off with an essay about how they don't deserve to rip, until I reread your comment lol. Maybe I should go to sleep. Ha <laughs> ha it's okay, get some rest. In pieces. Good. Wipe them all out. I hope the SBU gets some good inspiration from them. What did they think was going to happen? It's just a matter of time. I kind of thought they'd make it a priority since it would make winning easier. Waiting until it's all over to get the people calling the shots seems a little pointless. Good riddance. Why not now? If they're an opportunity, go for it. Most of their best guys are busy in Gaza and or trying to gather intel for that operation. They need to gather intel on the targets and plan their move. Get operatives into Qatar with fake work permits, etc. Also killing one of them will tip off the rest making him extra paranoid. You don't use your access and opportunity to kill one man, you use that target to gather intel on all the rest by following the money and communications. Also Mossad does fuck up, and when you fuck up a black ops it's bad. Like, bad. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.